Hi friends, I hope you're doing well. I'm here to swatch five more shades of the Maybelline Vinyl Lipsticks. These are technically called the Super Stay Vinyl Ink Lipsticks. I have done swatches of the original shades, they launched nude shades, and so I did swatches of those. And then I saw somebody commented on that video that Target had five more exclusive shades. This collection of five colors is technically called Rouge Rose, and there are five more colors. And I was like, well, I have to try the rest of them. So that's what we're gonna be doing today. You guys already know I love this formula so much. It's incredible. Such a long wear kind of a lipstick, and they have so many amazing shades. So we're gonna start off with the more nude shade, which is called Dainty. It's kind of like a pink. Well, I don't know if I wanna say it's nude, but it's like the lightest or most muted out of the bunch. I'm gonna try to work quickly here because once these dry down, they don't move. So I just wanna make sure I get them all swatched. Oh my goodness, my lip lines, they're not very even today, but you get the point. This is such a gorgeous color. It's a really, really pretty wearable pink. I think this is a color that's perfect for when you don't know what to put on your lips, but maybe you have something really soft on the eyes and your outfit is really casual. I feel like a color like this is perfect to pair with a vibe like that. So this is dainty. Next, we're gonna be trying this shade. This is called Hot. You wanna give these a really good shake before you use them. Ooh, <gasps> this is a really, really cool, like watermelon pink shade. Ooh, I like this one. This is even more fun than the first one. So I feel like a similar vibe, but a little bit more of a punchy pop of color. I think this is gorgeous, especially with spring and summer coming up. Oh my gosh, I love that one. I was not expecting that color to come out of this. I don't know, I felt like it would be a little darker, but I really love that shade. So again, this is hot. Next, I'm gonna be trying the shade Restless, which looks like it's gonna be more orange. Again, we're gonna shake it. Ooh. <gasps> They all kind of have more pinky undertones. It's really pretty. So this is like a pinky orange. Okay, so far this whole collection is so pretty. This kind of has like a peachy coral kind of a feel to it, but there's still a good amount of pink in here. So it's really wearable. Another amazing color for spring and summer, but especially springtime. I feel like a color like this paired with a denim jacket, you know, just mascara on the eyes, it's, it's a vibe, okay? I don't know, that's at least how I picture wearing this color for myself. This with denim, yes. So pretty, okay, we have two more. Next, we're gonna be swatching this one right here, which is called Eccentric. This is one of the reds out of the range, but maybe it has pink in it. It sure does, folks. It's like a pinky red. Okay, so far, every single color is so flattering that I've tried. This is more of like a raspberry red. All of them are so wearable and so flattering. I just, I can't get over it. I really felt like it was gonna be more vampy, but maybe that's just because I'm used to more of those super bold colors in the first 10 shades that they launched that I swatched. But these are actually pretty soft. Maybe it's because of that pink undertone. Oh, it's such a gorgeous raspberry. I don't know if I can pick a favorite yet out of these. I'm surprised. I did not expect to love every single color. We do have one more to try, but so far, these are incredible. Last but not least, we're gonna swatch this one right here, which is called Moody. Is this gonna be like a pinky brown? I don't know, I'm just guessing. I haven't opened this one. <gasps> Ooh, I think it is. Ooh, that's a really cool color. This is the most cool toned out of the five. That's actually so pretty. I don't feel like I have a color quite like this. This one's more of like a statement on me, but still in a very like soft approachable way. It's not too bold to where it's like, ah, you know? <laughs> oh, it's so pretty. I don't even know how to describe this color. It definitely feels mauve, but there's also some cool browns in there as well. This in the fall for like every day, so pretty. It's definitely not like a spring color like the other ones, but still a really, really nice shade. And I feel like it's so unique. Gosh, I really like this one too. I can't decide you guys. So those are all five. Should we create like a lip look with them? I usually do that. Let's try it. I'm just gonna line the lips. This is the Tower 28 um, work of art lip liner. And I actually really loved the raspberry one. So I'm gonna take this one and kind of apply it on the outside of the lips or like the outer corners, you know what I mean. And then I wanna take this one, hot. I thought this was such a cool color and do this in the center and then try to combine them before they dry all the way down. Okay, and then I'm just gonna let that dry. I'm feeling inspired by this color. So I wanna take a little bit of the Too Faced blush in the shade. <gasps> did I just dig my nails into that? No, I totally did. Darn it. Mm -hmm. Oh well, not too bad. Okay, in the shade Watermelon Rain, 
This is a very bold color. I feel like my cheeks need a little bit of that raspberry to match the lip. Okay, so what did you guys think of these bonus Target exclusive colors? I feel like with the other ones, it's pretty clear to me which ones are my personal favorites. With this bunch, I really don't know. Like I'm gonna have to watch the video back and decide all over again because I don't know what my all time favorite is out of all of them. They're all so unique. It's such a fresh color range that again is so perfect for spring, I'm telling you. I'm really excited to wear all these. And even this one, like this might not be a pop of color for spring, but it's such a unique shade that I'm like, I, I really enjoyed all five. I would love to hear in the comments down below which shade you like the best on me or if you've tried any of these five from Target. Let me know what your favorite color is. I will of course have the other two videos that I've made with these lip products in the description box down below so you can check out the nudes range and also the original 10 that they launched swatched on my lips. I even did a wear test in the first video which is why I don't do wear tests anymore with these because I already know how much I love them and how well they wear. So if you want to see how well they wear you can watch that first video. But yeah I hope you guys enjoyed this lip swatch video. I thoroughly enjoy a good lip swatch video. So I'm glad you guys have enjoyed the Maybelline swatches in the past. Let me know if there's other lipstick ranges that you would like to see me swatch, drugstore or high end. I would love to hear from you. If you're new here, hi, my name is Allie. I would love for you to join the family. You can do so by hitting the subscribe button. And if you're already a subscriber, we want to be notified on Tuesdays, Thursdays, and Saturdays at 10 a.m. Pacific Standard Time. Click on the bell after you subscribe and you'll get a notification every single time I post. That's it for me today. I hope you all have an amazing day wherever you are and I will see you in my next video. Love you. Bye.